So this is just a short post because I've had the question pop up about file security and I think a lot of people don't know about this. Very commonly you'll have problems with your WYSIWYG file picker and things because file security permissions are wrong. So basically to do that, here I am on a DNN website, I would go to the file management and of course I can now go to something and set the file permission specifically, but typically you would actually go to the root or to whatever folder you have. Uh, for example, we place all our content in a content folder and configure the WYSIWYG to only show this folder. But no matter where you are or what you want to do, go to the folder that you care about, go and check the folder properties, and in here there's a not so known tab showing permissions. Now, typically users, you're going to want to give them open files, for example, maybe you want to give them browse permissions. Note that these things are usually not so critical, but for example, if users, all users don't have open files, you'll have trouble browsing it. You could now say registered users, but it doesn't make much sense. Basically, this is usually not used for security because a direct download of the file will not be checked by DNN anyways. This is more in the UI offering users to look at it. So give it the permissions you want. Very likely all users read, maybe registered users read and browse files, something like that. Save it. Now, maybe you could press the copy permissions directly, but just to be honest, I'm not quite sure in which sequence DNN does this stuff. So I like saving it first and then press copy permissions. And now these permissions will be propagated all the way downwards through your tree. If you don't do this, DNN does not really know what security to apply and will have trouble showing it in your WYSIWYG. So this is Daniel Mettler, Tusic Internet Solutions. I hope this helped you understand a little bit more about file permissions and check out my other blogs about grunt, too sexy content, whatever. Thank you for watching.